Hey, this is Gabriel with Duplicating Systems, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create Canon printing presets for your Windows device. In this video, I'll be creating two different presets, black and white single-sided with a department ID, and color single-sided with a department ID. So there are many ways to create presets on your Windows device. You can use a desktop app or a web browser. And in this case, I'm going to be using Google Chrome because I find it to be the most reliable. So the first step in creating these presets specifically is setting up department IDs. Now, unfortunately, you cannot set your department ID within your preset menu. So department IDs operates in a different kind of menu, and I'll show you how to get to that right now. So first, go down to your search bar and type in printers and scanners. From here, click on the printer you want to create a department ID for, and in this case, it's going to be for this Canon 3530. Click Manage, Printer Properties, and now go to Device Settings, and here under User Management, click Department ID Management, and now Settings. And in here, go ahead and type in your department ID. In this demo, it's going to be 1234, and you may see your settings at first like this and it's going to have this box that's grayed out and it says confirm department ID when printing you don't want that because it'll it'll make you confirm your ID every time you have to print and that may become very tedious so to turn that off click allow pin settings and uncheck this box and of course type in your department ID right here and then click verify And now the department ID has been verified by my printer, and I can click OK, OK, Apply, and OK. So that's the first part of the preset, uh, setting up the department ID. Now we can actually go about creating the preset. So go back to Google Chrome, go to Print, Print using System Dialog, scroll over to the printer you're creating presets for. In this case, it's going to be the 3530, Preferences. And from this menu, you can go ahead and create your presets. So the first preset I'm going to create is black and white single-sided. All I have to do is go to this drop-down box, click one-sided printing. Under color mode, click black and white, and that's it. I can now click add, and I can name this preset black and white single-sided department ID. And now I'm going to create the second preset, which is going to be color, single-sided with the department ID. All I have to do is change the, change the color mode, and now I can name it. Color, single-sided, department ID. And that's it. These are two very common presets that we make for our customers. Uh, we find them to be excellent starting points for more complex printing jobs. So first you want to decide if you're doing black and white or color, and then once you've decided, you can go through this menu and make them more complex. Um, but if you make any changes to these presets and then print, it'll use those changes, but it'll reset back to the defaults of that preset. So if you have multiple kinds of printing jobs that you do at your work, I encourage you to create multiple presets and then quickly select them when you want to use them. These presets are available anywhere on your computer now, on any desktop app or web browser. If you have any questions, feel free to ask us down in the comments below or contact us directly at Duplicating Systems. Our contact information is in this video's description. I hope this video helped and thank you for watching.